Yeah, so this is Miss Collins. This is Miss Collins, aka Miss Salt Light that is for the T. I'm inside of one of the buildings under my current management. They're telling me that they don't have a two bedroom available, when in actuality they do. And it's right here. Okay, so <coughs> this building is under my management office. Okay, what I noticed about this building, it's small, it's little, they don't have a lot of people living in here, it's only three levels, so if you look across the street through here, it's only first, second, and third, that's what it has, so <coughs> my management office is located at 575. Howard Avenue, Brooklyn, New York, and my property manager told me that they don't have available apartments on the lower level unit when in actuality they do. According to the residents in this building, this is building 607, according to the residents in this building, this apartment that I'm about to show you, this build, this apartment, it's a two bedroom apartment and it's been vacant for a year, okay, and that's here, this is it here. That's it right here. Okay. My thing is this. If this apartment has been vacant for a year, why wasn't it shown to me? It was, it's under the same management that I currently live. It's just a matter of saying, Ms. Collins, I mean, you're not losing funds. You're keeping the funds, but you're just changing the account number. You're changing the account number from my two-bedroom apartment to this two-bedroom apartment. The funds are still in the management office. It still, it still stays in Nitra, so I don't understand the big to do. Okay, <coughs> let me just come out. Okay, this is 607. That's the apartment, the building number. Further down here, right there, is the management office. Right there. Okay, like I said, it's three stories. And this is available. So, <coughs> this is the building number under this. Okay, so now management is going to say to me, Oh, Miss Collins, this, that apartment is already taken. No, it's not. Because I just spoke to every resident in this building, just about. And they told me that this apartment has been vacant for a while. Actually, one of the residents told me that she even he heard pe hears people breaking into that apartment over there here because nobody lives there it's just easy transfer I don't even understand what's what's the big deal I, I don't get it anyway yeah this is Miss Collins um I asked to speak to the property manager the office is right there <coughs> And all I keep hearing is that she's in a meeting, she's in a meeting, she's in a meeting. I don't, I don't even understand this. This building, for what I understand, um, it has a tenant patrol. So let's just see if it's covered by a tenant patrol. I'm going to walk it up a bit. I think I showed you guys this before. This building has a tenant patrol, which is what I am asking NYCHA to put me in a building that has, you know, tenant patrol. <clears throat> so let's see. As I'm walking, I have a tenant patrol. I think I want to see, because I was told that it does. Now, I'm also walking towards the management office. Okay, here we go. <coughs> See that? Tenant patrol. Okay. Now, I just showed you guys the building where there is a vacancy. Now, we're walking towards the management office. <coughs> This is Miss Collins. This is Miss Collins. This is 
the management office here. This is the management office right there. Okay. I'm going to walk it back down. The management office. All I'm asking is for a transfer to a lower level. They want to show me all these other different apartments and all these other developments. That's not what I'm asking for. What I'm asking for is a simple transfer. I am a resident who is in good standing. I'm in excellent standing. Excellent standing. I don't owe nobody nothing. I make my own repairs. Um, I don't cause any problems other than reporting and recording issues and concerns that I shouldn't even have. I shouldn't have no issues and concerns. And none at all. None whatsoever. Okay, so this is, again, this all belongs to my, man, my property manager. This all belongs to her. This belongs to my property manager. And all she has to do, you're probably saying it's not that easy. Yes, it is. It's easy. <clears throat> it's easy. It's easy. This building here. This unit here is vacant. The residents on this side here told me, and I asked them today, is that, vac is that apartment vacant? They said, yes. Yes, it's vacant. It's been vacant for a very long time. And it is a two bedroom. So, um, <clears throat> I don't understand. All they need to do is take me from my fourth, my fourth floor unit, two bedroom unit, and bring me down to this one fourth floor, uh, first floor unit, which is also a two bedroom. It's as simple as that. No money is being taken out of NYCHA by doing that. You're not losing any funds by doing this. All you're doing is changing account numbers. You're changing my account number from what it is to this account number for here. It's that simple. I, I don't even understand the big to do. Anyway, this is Miss Collins. Um, my next video that I'm going to show you guys is what they were sh what was shown to me today. Okay, I showed you a unit. Um, I'm going to be showing you a unit <clears throat> that was shown to me today. Um, I made a video in regards to this particular unit but what I did was I showed you the hallways I only showed you the hallways to this unit I didn't show you inside the unit so the video that I'm going to show following this video is the inside of the of a unit in the actual building so stay tuned for that one see you guys